Hey everybody, welcome back to another video and today we're going to talk about your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus proximity sensor is not working after updating the iOS 15. Now the question is what is the proximity sensor and how does it really even work? Now when you get the incoming call on your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus and when you try to place your iPhone right next to your ear and when the sensor get covered by your ear then the light goes off. Now if the proximity sensor don't work then what happens each time you're gonna pick up a call but when you just try to place it right next to your ear you see the lights will be turned on which is annoying and a lot of people wanted to know how they can solve the problem. Now, before I tell you more about the problem, how you can solve it out, the first things you have to be sure is your screen protector. Now, often the screen protector can be the main cause for this problem. Then we highly recommend you go ahead and just remove the screen protector to see if there's any changes or not. If you see even after you know changing the screen protector, nothing is working out, then we would highly recommend you go ahead and clean your sensor with a piece of cloth and just to check whether this is gonna help you or not. Even after cleaning your sensor on your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus, if you see still you got a problem, the next things we will recommend you to do, just go ahead and press and hold your power button and that home button together unless you see the Apple logo appears on your phone. Okay everybody, now after giving a forced restart on your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus, the next things you gotta do to solve your problem is to check the new software update. If you type your settings, you scroll down here, tap on general, and then tap on software update. Now, if you came across any software update for your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus, go ahead and do it to solve your problem. Because often, the minor software glitches and bugs can be removed or can be kicked out by the new software update. Now once you have taken out the new software update, if you see there's nothing and no fix available, then that could mean you got a serious problem with your sensor. I mean, it can be, you know, hardwarely damaged or something like that. Now to solve your hardware related issues, you need to take your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus to the Apple Care to solve the problem. Now before you go to Apple Care, there's one last thing that you can check which is the reset all setting just to check whether this last thing is going to help you out or not. And if you're going to do the reset all settings, the first things you got to do, open up your settings and come down to your general and come down to your transfer and reset iPhone and here tap reset and now choose reset all settings. Now tap reset all setting twice and then your iPhone is going to take a restart and this is going to remove all those customized settings that you have changed on your iPhone so far. Alright guys, so these are the ways you guys can follow on your iPhone 6s and 6s Plus to solve your sensor. I mean the proximity sensor is not working on your devices. Hope you find this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later.